Hi everyone, in this video we would learn how we have to download Scopus journal papers list. So those are the Scopus index journals we have to download and those are the discontinued journals we will download that list also. For this purpose what we have to do because number of research scholars said ma'am how we have to get Scopus journal list scopus.com simply we have to write scopus.com then we will press enter i think uh, what happened let me check scopus.com right so moment you will press scopus.com so you can see this interface will open and in this interface you can see scopus content left hand side you can see this segment and here is content coverage, content coverage guide and uh, you can download this particular guide also. Scopus source list, then the book title list, then Scopus discontinued sources list. So when you have to click here, Scopus source list, right? It will, a moment after this, you can see here, it will start downloading. Now you can see that is the April 2022 onwards this list is in this list is acceptable so i have already downloaded rather than i have to wait so let me open this list so now you can see after downloading this list we can see here this is the database that will open now i can show you here is this is the database here is in the first column that is the source source title, print ISSN number, EISN number, and you have to click here, enable editing. After this list is downloaded, then you can see here, in this column, active or inactive, that is the most important column, active or inactive. That means this journal is active or it is not active right so those are the inactive journals you can see this particular journal that is a a and a case reports that is inactive so don't send your paper in this particular journal because this journal is inactive right and here is coverage also and now you can see title history indication related title to title history each and everything that is given right business management journals after this you can see there are number of tabs i can show you this one is the first tab scopus source october 2021 then after that accepted titles as per april 2022 so here is i'm just showing these titles these are accepted or these titles are included in your scopus database so that is date, even month is also mentioned here, February 2022, February 2022, right? And who is the publisher, December 2021, November 2021, each and everything is given over here. So who is the publisher? So like if we talk about Journal of Risk and Financial Management, that is MDPI, Multidisciplinary Digital Publishing Institute. This is the journal and that date of acceptance is April 2020-22. So accepted titles in the process of being added to Scopus. Next tab, next tab is discontinued titles April 2022. You can see it is a huge list that these titles are no more included in the Scopus database. These titles are discontinued from Scopus index, Scopus database. So now title per subject area, serial conference proceedings, all conference proceedings, right? All these things, all the tabs are available over here. So I'm sure here is you can use your filter also here. You can see there are two categories, right? So let me stop. I don't want to see active. I just want to see inactive journals. So now you can see these number of journals, those are inactive, right? And those are read. That means these journals are discontinued also. 
right so don't send these papers your paper in these journals because these journals are inactive but if suppose you want to see active so automatically please presses and this deselect this inactive and only active journals would be here accepted titles now if you are sending your paper in all these journals so that would also accept that would also consider because these are already included in the scopus database you can see here that is ieee transactions on african intelligence ieee institute of electrical and electronics engineers so this paper this journal is already included clean technologies right that is mdpi journal that is also included and you can find out any journal then you can select this journal to send your research work so i'm sure this video would be helpful to you after this i'm just showing you and the list that is the scopus books next uh, i had downloaded this particular these all are the titles of the book and print isbn number is here e isbn number as well as year publication year right and uh, publisher imprint each and everything is here if suppose you are publishing your chapter in this book so uh, that would be reflected in scopus database because these books are scopus and scopus book series january that is also reflected here book series volumes that is also reflected here right so how many how many total number of the volume number 1 2 3 publication year right so each and everything is available for here but when we talk about discontinued sources list that is unable to download i think there is the some error sorry the page you requested cannot be found so might be later or some other time we i could be able to show you discontinued list also those journals has been discontinued right so please uh, follow all these uh, journal list and keep sending your papers in these journals only don't send your paper in predatory journals uh, thank you keep watching